first and foremost, a cartoonist. That's my whole existence. When I was about seven, I, I had that book and had the little cartoons at the bottom, and uh, you know, I, I started copying the cartoons and having a bit of a go and seeing how I was. Got a little better after many, many years of drawing. Uh, writing happened much later. I self-published a couple of cartooning books, and then I, I published a book, a cartooning book with Penguin. And my editor said, oh, I really like the way you write, like, the, you know, it was kind of funny. Do you write anything else? And I went, yeah. I didn't, I, didn't, I didn't write anything else. But I had the idea, I said, look, I've got a great title for the book. It's called UFO, Unavoidable Family Outing. And she said, oh, sounds great, send it to me. So I wrote a couple of chapters and sent it, and she went, this is great, let's do a book. I'll go out to work and I'll, you know, be conducting, a, a presenting a workshop at a school or a festival or something like that. And then once that's done, for fun, I'll sit down and, and draw just as a way to go and this is my happy space. Sometimes, you know, make a, a cartoon strip of my day and send it to my wife. I mean, drawing, it's, it's so instant, it's lovely. I just love it, it's great. I've been doing this for a lot of years and the work kind of turns up. It turns up and you have to hunt it down as well. So usually it's a combination of write a book, do some drawings, go out into the world and, you know, do some things for the general public and, you know, all of those for me for the last 20 odd years or so has added up to a fairly normal kind of a job. Sometimes, yeah, sometimes the drawing is not as much fun as I would want it to be. And so every job has a part of it that, you know, you're not gonna like every single job, no matter how much you love your job. There's a bit of it that you just have to suck it up and go, okay. I, I did Disney Channel for a lot of years, which was good. I really, I, there was one time where I went, Walt Disney's writing my checks. This is great. So that was really cool. Like as a kid growing up wanting to be a cartoonist, that was pretty cool. I did, um, I wrote and illustrated two picture books most recently. So Time for Bear Daddy and Time for School Daddy. So Time for Bear Daddy is a role reversal book. So it's a little girl and she says, come on daddy, it's time for bed. And daddy's all, but I'm not tired. So she has to drag him off and get his jammies on and help him clean his teeth. And, uh, so we did Time for School Daddy, which came out whenever, a year or so ago. And we're now, uh, I've contracted to finish <laughs> Time for Adventure Daddy. So the manuscript is done, the illustrations have all been approved, and I'm just, you know, everything's inked up and I'm hand painting, like hand painting every one of the 32 pages, which is, uh, it takes its time. I haven't run out of ideas and I don't have enough lifetimes to, in which to live out all of my, my thoughts and my creative ideas. So, you know, ideas turn up. 